Welcome to my pitch about climate change. Climate change and why? I chose climate change as my topic because I find it interesting, so it motivated me more to find more about the subject and expand on my own personal views on the issue that we face as the British youth today. This also helped add to my work as there was quite a lot of interest in it. This topic is relevant to the British youth as this generation is the generation that is growing up to try and stop climate change and reverse what the industrial revolution put on our planet and the strain it created. The rapid growth of the temperature in the planet is at this moment unsustainable and we must begin to change. This topic is widely represented by the British youth in many ways like on social media and through protests. Mainly currently on social media due to not many protests being allowed because of coronavirus. But just because coronavirus is around does not mean we have to stop thinking about this huge issue that is probably more long term than coronavirus. My research. For my production I gathered lots of research before looking at many different people's views such as views from the Extinction Rebellion, as well as views from just your everyday person on whether they would go to protests or how they would like to change, or if they are already changing to stop climate change. As well as I watched short films and stop motions for both, so I could get a bit of inspiration on how I could put this topic into a stop motion or a short film. The stop motion that I watched used lots of bright colours, so I used that in mine to show that the world can be colourful and bright, but if we don't change, it could be dark and dreary. And then for the short film I wanted to do something factual, inspiring, something to, to maybe motivate people to change who haven't begun to change. And I watched a video that Greta Thunberg made where she talks about how we can change and what happens if we don't change. And I tried to put that into my own piece. How did I hit my target audience? Well, I hit my target audience in the stop motion by making it relatable to the British youth. I made, I made sure that people understood that you can just go and support a protest if you want to by making a banner and going to wherever the protest is happening and doing it safely by just walking through the streets, not getting involved with police and stuff. And as I said before, I want to make the short film to inspire, to show young people that we need to change and that we need to make this planet a sustainable way of living, not constantly rising the temperatures that we face. And that is how I feel I hit my target audience, and I think I did hit my target audience in the end. This is some of my videos. This is the short film, Making of a Protest. Now I would like to show you a short part of my short film. How did I produce these productions? Well, I produce these productions by using my own camera and various types of the different of Adobe software. 
The hardest aspect of producing these productions was creating the idea. I felt that I struggled to think of a way to include climate change so strongly into my piece of work that still was something spectacular to watch. And in the end I felt like I did that, but I also feel there was much area to improve in my idea generating, thinking and overall creating of my pieces. Um, but for the stop motion, the, the key part is I struggled to stay patient and create such a short thing that took so long to make by having to use, taking loads of photos every like two seconds and moving my Lego character inch by inch to try and get a flowing smooth view to it instead of it being jolty and cutty. And in the end I enjoyed both of these looking back. They were so fun to create and and do, as well as making the set for the stop motion was incredible and the music and the voiceover for the short film, creating that and thinking of that up was exciting and different to what I've been used to at school for the last five years. I believe both things ended up working well. Feedback. I feel my productions successfully hit my target audience as I have had many people say to me that they found the stop motion relatable and they feel like they could go to a protest when they begin to happen again and they understand that it is just that easy as well as people thought of my stop motion as interesting intriguing it was good to hear a different sort of view and they also said it was well made and created which made me feel very happy when I heard these responses that I feel like I had succeeded in my work. Moving forward, what have I learned? Well, I've learned to batch process as well as using various filming techniques in my short films and various different match cuts and as, as well as transitions to each different shot. What do I feel like I need to improve? I need to improve on my idea creating, as I said before, to make my productions be as creative and big as possible with a good strong idea because that's where it starts the base of your your creations begin with your ideas what am i good at i am good at video editing which is cutting it between smoothly and making all the shots just sort of flow together as well as voiceovers i feel like i am i'm quite strong at them and adding sort of music sometimes I feel like I can really put put its own touch on the piece I just want to say thank you for listening to my pitch and I really hope you enjoyed I'm Ollie James goodbye